Hello everybody, uh, today I'm making this real quick video to show you guys uh, the new way I've been testing uh, wind turbines. About a month ago, I went ahead and uh, went to test the new turbine in the, the smaller Ranger here. And uh, the F-150 is real good because you can lean against it, you had real support, but this one, you know, the, the cab comes up to about your thigh level, so it, it was very dangerous, I could tell, and it was not going to work. So I went ahead and took basically an old treadmill frame that I had left over from the free treadmills that I ripped the motors out of stuff. And I took some 4x4s and just uh, built the frame, put a nice pole on there, and uh, went ahead and secured it with two straps at four points. So it's actually in there really well. It's a fairly light, so I can take it in, take it out real easy. So uh, let me go ahead and show you a close-up of it and uh, show you how tall it is here. Okay, so basically it's just a steel frame with 4x4s and a bunch of bolts and a bunch of uh, exterior screws there. And let me show you how tall I have this thing. See, it's uh, pretty tall. So the, one of the main reasons why I actually had it that tall was I've gotten a few people uh, telling me that it was uh, not really an accurate test because of the, the wind coming up the windshield would increase the wind speed over the, the vehicle speed and wasn't very accurate. So I went uh, ahead and just added up a, a bigger pole so maybe that won't affect it quite as much. And how I actually uh, mount that, I, when it's unstrapped, I just lean it towards the back of the truck, go ahead slide in the turbine and then just lean it back up and strap it in so it's way up there. Uh, way higher than I could achieve otherwise. So, sorry about the wind here, it's picking up. Alright, so anyway, um, I will go ahead at the end of the video and show you guys kind of how I put it together. But it was real simple, didn't take very long at all. Just had to cut the 4x4s to length. And uh, as you can see there, actually I just used uh, whatever I had laying around for bolts and screws and all that good stuff. So, okay. Thank you for watching the video as always. Take care and God bless.